All right, we're gonna go try to find a croissant. We're on St. Paul Street. This is the heart of all Montreal. No, what are you doing? <laughs> He's always doing this. Trying to find Le Petit Dip. Le for Petit first. Dip. Have some croissant. Yeah. Croissant. Le Petit Dip. So a 7-Eleven is the English term for what we call a dip à neuf. So the first stop on Jim's coffee tour, this is <laughs> Le Petit Dip. Regardez, c'est pas magnifique. It's really cute. I want to show you guys. They have things to eat. They also have some souvenirs. Oh, and it's also Instagram. Every corner of this cafe is covered in items from the Victorian era. It has a really cute aesthetic. Oh, they have really cute stuff here. A unique atmosphere, super cute souvenirs, and if you look closely enough, you can even find some Canadian contraband. Montreal's known for their orange cones around the city. This is actually a salt or pepper. Oh, yeah, the salt. salt. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we found this cool little cafe called Le Petit Dip. They've got these wonderful chocolate croissants, which is what Juan Carlos wants. It looks really yummy, everybody. <laughs> it is. It's messy, I know. It's like dark chocolate. This croissant is fantastic. What do you think? Yeah, it's very good. It's dark chocolate, my favorite. Yeah. This was all on my bucket list. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here we have local markets. So a selection of Quebec's local products. Routine options. I actually own a t-shirt like this. The logo of the city of Montreal. It's hard to leave Le Petit Dep. You'll be sure to find something that you can't leave without. And who do we have in front being adorable and cute? Oh, look at this model. Guys, I can be there forever, <laughs> right? This night it goes warm, so yeah. yes, I can stay there forever too. Highly recommend it. And this little cafe is fantastic. If you're in Montreal, look it up.